Thank you for joining me for yet another unboxing video. And today we have another expansion for The Others board game brought to you by Guild Team Games and Cool Mini or Not, or CMON. This time it's Men of Faith, five hero figures and five hero dashboards. Great artwork on the front. Again, for an expansion for The Others board game, you need to have the core box set to use these characters in the game system. Again, Men of Faith. Let's flip this over and see what it's all about. The Men of Faith, as they're known, do not possess a particular team designation, but work very well with members from any faith protectorate or together as a group. Dr. Lairaj Kirpan Nath coordinates the band of desperate individuals with an accuracy and effectiveness that rivals even our most highly trained and experienced military minds. Again, you need the core box to play this. It was released in 2016 by Gill Team Games and Studio McVay. Coming over here, you got pictures of your boards. And of course, over here, the Men of Faith set brings a team of five new heroes, each with their own unique abilities to help the fight against the others. All of these men have been touched by faith in one way or another, making them valuable assets when facing the corruption, uh, excuse me, the corrupting forces invading our worlds. And there's small pictures of them. You get five detailed miniatures and five hero dashboards. So let's crack this bad boy open and see what kind of goodness we have on the inside. And of course, right off the bat, you see your dashboards, which are still sealed. And you have your figures. So I'm going to put the figures to the side. And we'll open these up again. I always use my knife on the side. I don't... Uh, I don't use it on camera because I don't want, if I slip, nobody wants to see that. Okay, here are your one, two, three, four, five dashboards. First one is Kirpan. He is the leader. Remarkable what a little player can, can accomplish. Special ability, divine protection. All others, all other heroes gain plus one shield. So that's good, plus one defense, that's really cool. Again, your corruption, just like I said in the other unboxings, you start off with five, I guess five, five health, and this is your corruption chart. Once you hit over seven on your eighth one, your, your character is destroyed. They've been taken over by the evil, uh, the others, they've been taken over by them. So the back just tells you the men of faith, so you can tell that. Right, so Kirpan is one of the boards that you get, okay? Rajiv, these creatures show nothing of sin. Manifest destiny, when you take voluntary corruption, you also gain the bonus one level higher. So again, you get an option. If you want to take corruption, to move it up here, it's because when, you have, when you're corrupted, you get some extra bonuses here. So no effect, right? All right, no big deal, but you get plus one, one plus one die. You get more defense, more strength, plus one, another die. So you could have plus two die. You get two of these, and then of course you get to choose what you want to do when you roll that die. But the problem is, the higher the corruption goes, once you go over seven, you hit, you have seven. Someone hits you, you get up, go up to number eight. Your character dies, even if it has still has all of its health. Okay, so there's your bruiser. So you got your leader. You got a bruiser. You got Augustine. For the wages of sin is death. I shall repay thee tenfold. Holy Spirit, if you roll more hits than needed to kill all monsters in a fight, you may heal one wound and one corruption. So you got seven, it moves down to six. That's a good guy to have around. Definitely a good guy. He's a bruiser. And there you go. Also love the artwork for, for this game. I really do. It really captures the feel for it. You got Z. Become one with the battle. Feel its ebb and flow. Student of the way. At the end of every fight you survive, mark yourself. You get plus one die to all rolls for each of these marks. So he's a shooter. So if you keep using them and you keep winning, you keep getting more and more dice, which is absolutely fantastic. Again, corruption's all the same on everybody. Again, these pop right out. And that's where you put your tentacle marker there to keep track of where you're actually located. Put that, I'll put that back in for now. Okay. And then you have a fixer. Bones. Dr. McCoy's here? No. It's different bones. 
Grant always said I had talent. I should have listened sooner. Improvise. Whenever you roll two or more eyes, I believe that's for, again, that's corruption die, I believe. You may also either destroy an acolyte, a fire, or a corruption token in your space. Ooh, that's very cool to get rid of the fire. That's very cool because that's actually very, the fire is very deadly. You take damage and your shield doesn't work against it. Uh, again, you have the same amount of corruption as everyone else does. That's a cool, damn it, Jim. Anyway, you got bones here. Not that bones, but this bones here. All right. Not the one from Star Trek. All right. And again, you got your figures. Let's take them out of the box. Oh, they're still taped up. Let me tape off it there. Like so. Let's just clean up. There it is. Here they come. So there's your leader. Just like anything else by Simon, high detail, nice sturdy figure, good looking figure, whether you paint them or you don't paint them. A lot of detail, unique sculpts, very, very cool. Yes, this is Z. This is going to be Augustine. That's that's pretty that's pretty badass, you ask me. Very very cool. And then we got Rajiv. We have Bruiser. Not sure what these weapons do. But they look really cool. And the last figure we have is right here. And this is uh, Bones. Very cool. There you have it. Very, very cool. So that's everything that's included in uh, the expansion. Men of Faith, which is used for the Others board game, which was put out, uh, released by Guillotine Games, Student McVeigh, and uh, Simon. Cool mini or not? So again, thank you for joining me for this unboxing video. If you enjoyed it, um, give us a like, leave a comment below. And of course, um, you could always hit the subscribe button. This way you find out whenever we release any new material or any new videos. Again, thank you for watching. Be safe, be well. Enjoy the rest of your day and we'll catch you on the next unboxing video.